Good good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Did you hear me? Uh, yes. Okay. So, how are you today? How are you today? Fine, teacher. Oh, so what did you do? It's Ah, uh, it's ah, it's school days, weekdays. It's Tuesday, right? How are you? Yes. How school? Uh, oh, can you say again? Are uh, you doing great in school? What did you do? I study math, English, uh, and uh, physics today. Oh, wow. Very good, as always. Okay, so, Chief, uh, we are going to continue what we had about, do you still remember hostess? Air hostess. Do you still remember that? Yeah, air hostess is a flight attendant, right? Okay, you, you remember that one? Yeah, okay. Let us, uh, let us continue our test on that that is get to yeah it get to test for reading and writing Okay, we're done with this and we are here yeah we're done with this do you still remember that we're done with this yes yeah right okay so we're here mm, we are now in questions 28 to 10 20, 35 rather yeah okay so we're done with this uh, wait for a while. Jeez, for a while. Okay, we're done with this, right? Yes. Yeah, so this is the next. It's 28 and to 35, okay? Because... Okay, so this is the one still. This is reading. Actually, this is under under reading and writing. So it is uh get to test uh get to I don't know get yeah get to test three test four get to test four okay so we're here okay so all you have to do you will have to read the article about working holiday you will choose the best word that is a b or c like what we had before and then of course there is space for each number before each number there are spaces that you have to write your answer of course so for questions 28 and 35 you have to mark a b c on your answer sheet i know you are very good with this chi and you know what you're going to do with this okay so i am very impressed with what you have the last time i still remember the last time you had with me uh with my class you got perfectly three consecutive perfect scores right and you've got one test got one wrong and one test too wrong right yeah it's very good yeah congratulations for that chi okay it's nice because you are already in cat and after cat that would be pet right yeah so you've been through with flyers you're done yes oh you've been through with flyers and everything 
you how many how how many years you've been studying in Pantado? Haven't been out here. Uh, almost been here. Almost? Yes. Can you can you please can you make your voice louder, Chief? Yeah, like that louder. How many? I don't remember. But Because as far as I assessed you, like I assess you, your your speaking, your your comprehension skills, you are very good. So I thought you were enrolled already before. You were enrolled before. Yes. Oh, you've been studying here or for your first time? Uh, I have enrolled here. Almost one year. Oh, just almost one year. Wow, very good. That's probably the reason why you're very good now. So, because, I mean, the way you speak, you can communicate well. And your comprehension, you're very smart in comprehending all and about the words. So, there are some words which are very uh, hard to understand. Because, because you're, you're still 12, right? 13. Ah, 13. So you're still 13 and some of the words yes. here are quite hard to understand. But I think you were able to answer that one perfectly. So I just thought that maybe you were staying here for, for quite long year. So you just stay here one year already. Wow. Okay. That's probably the reason. Uh, she, okay. Very good. Okay, so let us see how good you are when you will going to answer this one, okay? Let's see. Okay, here. So as what teacher Ann said, you will have to... Example, okay, here. So as what teacher Ann said here before, okay, let us see. Read the article about working holiday, that one. Choose the best word A, B, C for each 23 to 35, okay? For questions 28 to 35, mark A, B, C. Okay, let's see here if there are choices, 28 to 35. Okay, so this is supposed to be you were going to answer. That's 30, 27 to 35, okay, 28 to 35. But before this one, before you can answer, you will have to read the article first, okay? Okay. So this is the article that you will going to read about, about working holiday, okay? All we have to know, all we have to do is just to remember this one. Please try to remember the words here. We have here zero. It's already zero's answer is had. This year, she had a very interesting summer holiday, okay? The rest of the word here, kindly remember, okay? Cheese? Okay, good luck. Okay, so I will help you reading about that. You want? Okay. Teacher Ann will be the one to read. And then after Teacher Ann will read, you will read it all by yourself. Okay? Mary Daniel is a student in England. This year, she blanked a very interesting summer holiday. Okay? So she traveled past tense, blanked 15 other people to Rowan Zori, Mountains in Africa. Okay. They went, it's past tense again, there to help make a road blank, a forest between two big towns. Next, it was very difficult. Blank, there was no water to drink, no shops where we blank buy food, said Mary. 
It was also very cold and wet in the mountain. It is blank of the wet, wettest places in the world. Mary stayed past tense in the mountains blank six weeks. It was hard work, but she says it was the blank thing she has ever blank. She's hoping to return next year to do some more work there. As you can see here, this is about Mary. Mary is working in Rowan Zori Mountains, a very far mountains, which is somewhere in Africa. So as you can see here, she's most of the words they are using past tense. Can you see that? So please try to review your answer, I mean to read this article so you can answer properly, okay? Okay, go. Just tell me if you want to flip on the next page.
Okay, I will return now to the next page.
Okay, you done? Okay, so what is your answer for number two? One, uh, number 28. Let's go back to the story, okay? Okay, here, let's see. Let's try, okay. So actually, oh, and I don't know if we can have the answers here. Okay, I guess we cannot fill in the answers. Okay, here. So for 28, the answer is letter B. Are you, do you have a correct answer? What's the answer for 28? B. Letter B. Okay, very good. 29, your answer is? Letter? A. Okay, very good. Number 30. Letter B. Letter B. Very good. Number 31. Very good. Number 32. A. A. 33. A. 34. A. B. Very good. 35. Let her see. Wow. Jeez, you got it correct. Number one, with. Okay, number two, through. Three, because. Four, could. Uh, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. Number five is one. Six is four. Seven is best. And eight is, uh, am I right? Done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Let's go back to the story. Let us answer this one. Okay. Can you read it again? Please. This year she had a very interesting summer holiday. She traveled with 50 other people to the mountains in Africa. They went there to help make a road through a forest between two big towns. Okay. It was very difficult because there was no water to drink and uh, where we we could buy food, said Mary. It was also very cold and wet in the mountains. It is one of the wettest places in the world. Mary stayed in the mountains for six weeks. It was hard work, but she says it was the best thing she has ever done. She is hoping to return next year to do some more work there. Okay, very good. You got it correctly. Wow. Again, so 35, we're done with this. Let's move on to 36 to 40. So in this 36, this is part 6, 36 to 40, you will have to read the descriptions of some clothes. What is the word for each description? The first letter is already there. There is one space for each other letter in the word for each questions like 36 to 40 write the words on the answer sheet okay can you see that okay so example here you put this on your head it is hot hat okay now okay, let's see. just for an example okay this is very easy go cheese
Are you done, Chief? Ah, uh, 37. Okay, so it's okay. So for 36, what is your answer? Uh, yeah, of course, shoes. How about 37? What do you think? Uh, okay. Oh, is that correct? The answer is suit. Okay. Are you correct with this? No, you, you don't have answer. Okay. So, this will keep you dry in wet weather. What's that? Oh, 39? When the weather is too hot, long trousers, men and women often wear this t-shirt with a t-shirt. It is short. Poipi, what's your answer? Sweater. Oh, yeah, of course. So only this one is, you did not have the answer. Okay, it's okay. Okay, go. Let all oh, look at the pictures. Okay, look at the pictures we have here. This is the one that you did not, this is jacket and a trousers in the same color, like this. Okay, choose this one. This is the one. Okay, cheese. Okay, yes. let's move to here. In 41 to 50, I will be giving, you will have to complete these letters. Write one word for each one. For questions 41 to 50, write your words on the answer sheet. It's not a letter, you have to write your words, okay? here so can you write the words for 41 to 50 so based on the letter here okay i will just tell you yeah, no. so you will have to write here the word
It's right, I'm finished. Okay, Chi, you're done? Yes. Okay, so what is your answer for number 41? That, okay, I will read and please tell me the answer, okay? Dear Mike, I am sorry I could not come to you, to my party. You could not come to my party yesterday. John Blanc. Uh, don't tell me what. Okay, John told me you had a very bad, okay, will you be the one to answer? I mean, to read and answer it directly? Again, go. Uh, sorry, no, sorry, you could not come to my party yesterday. John told me you had a very bad cold and you had a bad bad. Are you feeling very now? It was a very good party. The nicest I have ever had. Lots of my friends were there and they gave me some lovely presents. I will tell you about the party when you come back to come back school on Monday. Very good. Okay. So, do you get the correct answer, Chief? Time to check. Yes. Okay. All are correct. Uh, number 49. I went back. I went back. Okay. So, what is your answer for number 49? I will tell, I will tell you more about the party when you come. Uh, when you come back. What's your answer? When you come back. By Monday, by school. Okay, by is your answer. Uh, uh, it's back. It's back. back to school, but the right answer what? is the right to answer. school. Okay, what is your answer for number 49? Uh, come to school. Uh, come, yeah, come to school. That's good. When you come to school, on Monday, you are correct. Correct? No, I write no, come, I back school. come back school. Ah, you write come back school on Monday. I will tell you more about the party when you come back to school on Monday. Okay, when you come to school on Monday. Okay, it's okay. It's only one wrong. Good thing. Very good. Again, very, very good, G. Okay, so we'll be until here. Next time we'll continue only few tests and we move we will move to test three. Okay, okay, or you will be the one to pick, I'll be picking up listening test after the reading and writing, okay? Okay. Okay, so you have question G? No. Okay, okay. So for now, thank you for being with teacher Anne and thank you for the time. Okay, okay. Okay, so please, Chi, if you have question, don't try to hesitate to ask me. You know the word hesitate? Yes. Oh, wow. Okay. If you have question, don't try to, don't try to ask, uh, don't try to be hesitate or be hesitant to ask me. Okay? Okay. Okay, so for now, teacher Anne will say goodbye. Thank you for the time, Chi. Bye-bye, teacher. Okay, see you. Good night. You sleep now because you still have school tomorrow, okay? Not tomorrow, I will be absent from school. My school will let all the children, uh, all the students um, to absent. Why? Because tomorrow my school has like a vegetable at school for the teachers. Ah, there is a teacher. Yeah, did you celebrate already the teacher's day? 
But tomorrow the teacher is full of blood. I don't know what it's called, but uh, one week later it will be the teacher's day. Ah, yeah, it's teacher's day. So probably they will be celebrating the teacher's day tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> yeah, of course. So in my school, we will be celebrating the teacher's day on Saturday. In my school. So we'll be going somewhere on Saturday because it's Teacher's Day. Okay, Chi. So for now, okay, thank you, Chi. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, teacher. Stay.